Um, this is one of those bosses that don't move and they don't have a ranged weapon. So you can kill them from a range and never have to get hurt. Yeah. And that's where... It's kind of cheap. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. Don't need a bow. And they don't use bow. But that, that's good. I, I want to heal somebody. Okay. Sarah, every turn you have to heal somebody. I don't care if they have full health. You heal them. You heal them because you need the experience, god dang it. Healers are so hard to train. In this one, they really are. But in, the, in FE8, they're really easy to train. It's just time-consuming. Like, you can take the time to, like, get hit by the boss and then heal yourself and get hit by the boss, but... Yeah, you can train them that way. Like, we may end up doing that later on. We may. I, I'm gonna like, do it off-screen. Yeah, we'll do it off-screen, because that, that'd be boring as a little, oh, you know. Yeah. But... That's are, are the best gonna, way to do it. it are is. we going to train on uh, the 10th level? Are we going to do a little training there? You want to. I usually do. Yeah, I mean, it's to. a good way to get your characters up. Then you can focus on the younger ones. I don't know why I'm moving. Heal me, Sarah. Heal your... Um, You're going to hurt you. Yeah. Because right? yeah. I want to. What, well, how, much, um, how much HP does Earth have? Uh, it's a good question. 17. Oh, yeah. Yeah, do it. When I used to, when I played this when I was a kid, I had to lay and kill every boss. <laughs> I think she was like level 15, 15 or 17. It's 15 or 17 when yeah. I got done with it. Then. Yeah. You can do that. Ah. Oh. <laughs> well. <laughs> that was very upsetting. <laughs> Nicely done, Mr. Epic. That should <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, oh my god. You, you, <laughs> you, you pick all the players, because I <laughs> I pick poorly. No, that was your choice. That, <laughs> that was not mine. We, 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 he heard that we are going to replace him later. I like Urk. <laughs> I like him, but he's really touchy as a, as a unit. <laughs> uh, goodbye. Well, let's be on our way, Urk. What blah, have blah, we blah, here? Blah, Another blah. wildflower? Perhaps a butterfly. That, that's Sane. <laughs> no, no, Sane's much gayer. I mean, Kent's much gayer. Trust me. What an absolutely delectable creature. Oh my! Are you one of Lynn's companions? Please, call me Sane. I'm Sarah. I serve House Ostia. Sarah? What a lyrical name. I am in the service of Castle Kaelin. Oh! So is Lynn a member of the Marquise's family? She is the granddaughter of our lord, the Marquess, or Marquise, or whatever the hell you say. <laughs> mm, such an important person. Sarah, what de Deviousness. deviousness are you com contemplating <laughs> now? Gee, <laughs> having a person of power in your debt is never a bad thing. You can't be serious. Oh, Sane, do you think we could join Lady Linus's company? She seems like such a nice person, and I would... Ever so much like to help her. I would have told you. Of course. That <laughs> we can't be happier. We couldn't be happier. <laughs> Why, we were only just saying how we need some more fighting power. Were you being hunted or something? Yes. It's an inheritance dispute. Assassins everywhere. Oh my. In that case, my healing staff and Urk's magic should come in handy. Well, I, I, um, it sounds dangerous. Your staff and magic would be extremely helpful. Please, wait here. I'll go and speak with Lady Lindis on your behalf. Unbelievable. This is fantastic, Herc! <laughs> Our good deeds will earn us gratitude beyond imagining! I... I, I think I'm going to be ill. I like Urk. Urk and Sarah as a, like, as a couple's awesome. I'm they're, sorry. I, I want to say they're opposites. They are, but they just work What's the so story? well. What's the story behind them? Like, really? Behind them? Urk uh, S is an escort for her, and that's basically it. But, like, Not how, like how, did he be, how did he become the escort? He was hired. Oh. Oh, yeah. okay. He was hired to be an escort. That must be very annoying for her. Uh, for him? Uh, he puts up with it. He gets used to it. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, he grows a bit of a fondness for her. <laughs> yes, my lord. She's, she's on! She's on route to Efren. I can't remember what I did with him, and I want to do another one. <laughs> Hold nothing <running> back! <laughs> no, wait, 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 I don't remember. I think I might remember. No, I don't remember. <laughs> You're very airy. I remember that. Do anything to finish this now! 
Was that it? <laughs> no. First, the old man, <laughs> and now the girl. They cling to life like a drowning man to a rock. Double the poison strength. If he struggles, hold him down and pour it down his throat. Once the girl is gone, Kaelin is mine. I will let no one stand in my way. My precious. You do such a good job. <laughs> I need a lot of practice. Blah, blah, At long last, blah, Lynn arrives in the land there. of her mother's birth. Lycia is a federation of territories, each one ruled by a powerful Marquess. Now, Lynn takes her leave of one of these territories, Athrin, Erefin, <laughs> and starts out to meet her grandmother, the Marquess of Kaelin. However, the Marquess's brother, Lundgren, hungers to rule Kaelin with an iron fist. He is preparing a <laughs> deadly welcome for Lynn, who stands to threaten his grasp for power. Is, is this where we get wrath? Yes. Yeah. This is where we get this is where we get another shitty archery in it. We're not using Matthew. We're not using Matthew. What? Of course we're using Matthew! Why are we using Matthew? Because he's good! 